Hey guys, it's me, Ego here. Hi. Hello. Today, I have with me here all 20 colors of the renewed Roman Zero Matte lipsticks. Since it's a brand that I'm personally a fan of, I'm very excited to do a review on them. So, let's get started right away. The renewed Roman Zero Matte lipsticks has returned in a variety of 20 colors. The case design has also been changed to a more luxurious design that is slightly slimmer, hotter, and matte that slightly reflects inside when compared to the previous one. Not only has the case has been renewed, but if you look at the lipstick inside, you can see that the cutting part is also new. There's an engraving of the Roman logo, and it now has a single-sided cut with slightly curled shape. It has the zero gram texture that feels light as if it's not applied, light adhesion that applies slightly, and a soft, smooth texture. Although it's matte, it's not stiff, so if you apply it only lightly and smoothly, it shouldn't feel dry. Overall, I can see that there are colors from ranging from nude to red, moody, and vibrant colors. And when looking at their website, the colors were divided to nude, red, mood, and live. Since they apply on softly and sticks on the lips as soon as they're applied, it smears less than expected. Personally, when it comes to matte lipsticks, I think of a very drying and stiff lipstick that hurts lips and exfoliates dead skin, but since this product applies on so softly, I didn't have any worries. Overall, all the colors seem to be pretty enough when used alone, but I think they'll also be great as a base and mixed with other colors. As I've mentioned just before, the colors are divided into nude, red, mood, and live, right? There are various red colors here in red, so I'll start to swatch by recommending each tone that matches each red color. Number 1 Dusted Pink is said to be Mute Pink MLBB with a pink color faded to gray. It seems to be a color that gives off a natural feeling even when applied in gradation or in full lip and it's a color that belongs to mood. Number 2 All That Jazz is said to be Brick MLBB color like that of Grounded Bricks to Softness. But when applied, I think it's more like a burnt coral color mixed with white and it's a color that belongs to mood and is said to be the best color. Number 3, Silhouette, is said to be Marcella MLBB color, which reveals the charm hidden in the sunset. It's literally a MLBB Marcella color, and it seems to give a sexy vibe. It's also a color that belongs to mood. Number 4, Before Sunset, is said to be pink MLBB color that captures the softness of the sun before sunset. But in reality, it seems to look a bit plumish, more saturated orchid pink color, and it's another color that belongs to mood, and it's said to be one of the best colors. Number 5, Evening, is said to be brown MLBB color that'll create an all wearing vibe under the sunset. I find it to be more like a red and brown mixed brick color than MLBB. It's a color that belongs to mood and it's said to be one of the best colors. Number 6, Awesome, is said to be white felt pink color that covers purple lips brightly. I personally find it to be a strawberry milk color that feels warm pretending to be cool. It's a color that belongs to nude. Number 7, Envy Me is said to be a salmon brown MLBB color that looks natural just like your own lips. It's really a color that looks very natural and make the lips look like as their my lip color. It's a color that belongs to nude. Number 8, Adorable is said to be a bright coral MLBB color which is lovely enough to bite. But in reality, the color seems to feel more scarlet and vivid. It's a color that belongs to nude. Number 9, Shell Nude is said to be a nude base color of white shells on the sun covered sand. This color reminds me of apricot and seems to be great to use as a base. It's a color that belongs to nude and is also one of the newly added colors. Number 10, Pink Sand is said to be a cool pink nude base color with a drop of white in a toned down pink. It's a color that belongs to nude and is also a new addition to the collection and I think it'll be great to use for cool tones who want a natural lip expression. Number 11, Sunlight is said to be a hot clear pink red color that resembles a dazzling sunlight. I find this to be more pinkish since it shows more pink. It's a color that belongs to life. Number 12, Something is said to be a popping coral red color. The color is a meeting of a pure coral and red and is a color that belongs to life. Number 13, Red Carpet is said to be an alluring cool red color that seems to be touching of a luxurious carpet. I think it's a color that reminds me of Ruby Oo and is a color that belongs to red and is said to be one of the best colors. Number 14, Sweet Pea, is said to be plum color with a drop of gray, like a dry purple sweet potato peel. Since it's a color that belongs to life, I think it feels brighter than I thought, and it seems to go well with winter. Number 15, Midnight, is said to be a chic plum burgundy color that is like the darkness that'll make me shine even more brightly. The color seems to go well with the product name and looks similar with Sweet Pea but feels deeper. It's a color that belongs to mood. Number 16, Dazzle Red is newly added color. It's an orange red color that is bright and shiny as if you're drinking an orange blossom cocktail. 
it belongs to red and is said to be a red color that gives vitality to deep spring warm tones when applied on any color. Number 17 red here is newly added color which is said to be an unbiased, warm, cool, peaceful, real red color. It belongs to red and is said to be a standard red color for all warm and cool tones. It's also recommended for beginners who find it difficult to use red. Number 18, Tanning Red is another newly added color which is said to be a brownish toned down red color that looks like a sunburn. It belongs to red and is a color for autumn warm tones which is said to create a deep underground mood. Number 19, Red Surfer is newly added color which is said to be pink red color filled with blue waves like cool wave that will cool the heat. It belongs to red and is said to be a red color that gives coolness to summer cool tones that has been worn when applied on any red color. Number 20, Red Dive is a new added color which is said to be a cool and deep red color of the deep sea that divers come across. It belongs to red and is said to be the it color which can create a synergy with cool deep cranberry red color for winter cool tones. When removing them once, I could see that they all had a bit staining, but when removing them twice more, since number 1 to number 10 are light colors and number 11 to number 20 are deeper colors, I think the colors on the bottom have a stronger stain. I think all the colors are very atmospheric and they seem to be a collection of pretty colors. I personally like all the colors, but I especially like number 9 and number 5. And on the side, they mentioned that when they're mixed with the reds in other tone categories, they're creating more beautiful synergy nude combination. So I'll finish the video by showing you those combination and my favorite combination. Synergy nude combinations recommended by Roman. First, they recommended a warm tone combination by using number 9 shell nude and number 17 red heat. And second, a cool tone combination by using number 10 pink sand and number 19 red surfer. And my favorite combination is number 9 shell nude and number 5 evening. So this was my soft training review of the newly renewed Romance Zero Matte Lipsticks. Thank you for watching my video today. Don't forget to subscribe, press the like buttons, and please leave some comments for me. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!